yo yo what it do youtube it's your boy brian felix here bringing you guys another video i just want to say thank you guys for tuning into this video here make sure you guys like comment share and subscribe so as you guys see here you see the thumbnail and everything like that we're doing a full uh detail and a full wash on this range over here so we're just gonna go ahead and start with the same process as we always do and uh, and that is spraying our wheel acid cleaner on the rims right so we're just gonna go ahead and spray our uh wheel acid i'm gonna go ahead and follow up behind danielle and go ahead and rinse that off after letting it sit about two to three minutes you know and that alone would knock off a lot of the brake dust i get a lot of questions of people saying how do you clean the wheel so fast and that is by far one of the quickest ways that i've you know learned from my buddy uh nash mobile detail so that's what we're doing here we're just gonna go ahead and rinse down the car door jams all that good stuff after we remove the wheel acid and as i'm doing that danielle's going ahead and cleaning the wheels like i mentioned most of the dirt and debris will be knocked off with that wheel acid cleaner which i bought from stinger so if you guys want to check it out you can and then we're following up with our super clean and you know just wheel well brushes and small detail brushes to get the, the rims and the lug nuts and stuff like that the uh soap that we are using here is going to be chemical guys citrus wash and gloss uh, i love this product here especially for newer clients you know we want to make sure that we get a lot of the dirt and debris off their car so that's a very good option to go ahead and you know starting off with so i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys enjoy a few shots here of just us working and then i'll get back to talking about the interior So now we're done with the outside we're gonna go ahead and move into the interior of this range rover now this client does have kids you guys will see the back of the seats here in a second kids seem to be kicking and you know putting their dirty shoes on the back of the seats there's just crumbs everywhere so it just needed a very very good thorough vacuum which is what we did we also went ahead and used our vote vortex cleaning gun along with our air compressor i also get a lot of questions about the air compressor it is a rigid 4.5 gallon i believe when i bought it, it was like 250 maybe 300 bucks uh and then the reel and stuff like that with the holes reel was probably like another 80 or 100 bucks with the gun and everything like that so you know you guys should definitely invest in one i you know highly recommend you do that we're gonna go ahead and run two guns on our new setup as well so make sure you guys stay tuned for that because i found out that you know I myself when i'm detailing i like to use the compressor and then the person that's vacuuming likes to use the compressor and it's very beneficial for the both of us to go ahead and use it right so it might as well just get two guns uh even though you know it might take a little while, a little while to you know let the tank fill up and stuff like that but the compressor is built to handle two different tools uh at the same time so we're gonna go ahead and upgrade and you know add that to our addition and our new setup coming soon so as you guys see we got leather uh leather seats here kind of just you know like a white tannish color and we went ahead and used our detailing leather seat brush here gave it to me by julian from just clean shout out to you brother he gave me this as a gift he was like man here take it uh and i'm actually gonna go ahead and order some more because this one's kind of just it's a little old but hey I'm, I'm thankful and grateful he did give me the opportunity to try it out and so far i love this thing it's better than going in there with the scrub ninja the little uh gray square you guys know what i'm talking about it just covers a lot more and we're using super clean 
uh diluted 10 to 1 here just to clean off the seats and stuff like that and also the center console and the doors and everything like that is all super clean we're not using anything expensive or fancy we try to keep everything you know as super simple as possible so no mistakes are made throughout the detailing process Alright, so I know this was kind of a short video. Honestly, I didn't get to record too many, you know, different clips and stuff while we were out here working. I just, you know, haven't been feeling the best to record and stuff for YouTube, but I'm just trying my best to still put out content for you guys. So I hope you guys do appreciate this uh, video here. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't because a lot of you guys aren't. Make sure you share, comment down below any questions, check out the links with all the products and tools and the link in the description down below. But without further ado, hustle never settle. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Let's go.